This week on Africa 54, we are highlighting U.S. President Barack Obama's Mandela Washington Fellows Program. The initiative empowers 500 young Africans through academic coursework, leadership training, and networking. Joining us now with more on the Mandela Fellows is Africa 54's Esther Gitui Yuvot. Thanks, Leno. One year after participating in President Barack Obama's Young African Leadership Initiative, now called the Mandela Washington Fellowship in Washington, 28-year-old Nde Absanging is back in Senegal, her home country, and thriving. VOA's Maria Madialo visited her recently and reports on how the leadership initiative has benefited her. The Absanying was the software group marketing leader for North and West Africa for computer giant IBM, but has since been promoted. I'm the software cloud portfolio manager for Middle East Africa and Turkey. And her fashion brand of clothing, ABC or Aduna Boule Comprendre, is flourishing. I'm still handling ABC, which is my brand, more than 26,000 fans on Facebook and growing. In the capital city, Dakar, Nying says she used to be called a bulldog with lipstick because her focus was all about making money. But after studying at the University of Texas in Austin and participating in Yali, everything changed. Helping out at a food bank really opened her eyes. The way you just step back and have a look at the world and say, okay, this is a whole ecosystem where I can benefit from each other through networking and where I can help other through community services, it's just an outstanding view of how I, I benefited from Yali. She's also been involved with helping women prisoners find a new life through arts and crafts. Their work is exhibited at this gallery. One would think she has her hands full. Not exactly. She describes her brand new project called Jeter. It's an association helping on entrepreneurs to start um, thinking and envisioning their future, not only leaning on an employment uh, opportunity, but really creating the path through to their own, um, let's say, personal development. She meets with a group of associates to brainstorm on how to make it successful. And the idea is to really help in mentoring younger people, what we call the next generation of leaders, so that really we help in having more Yalians, why not, even if they don't have the chance to go and get there and meet with President Obama. They might be having the very same chance that I've got with my other fellows. Yet another way for Ndeyap Sanying to give back to her community. Maria Madialo, VOA News, in Dakar.